Yo, what up, everybody? Come back to another video. Ten most of their ranked teams caught on it. Double camera footage. Before we get into it, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. If this ain't your first time, if this ain't your first time watching, or if it is, and you ain't subscribed yet, please, really appreciate it. Now, let's get straight into it. Yes, sir. We definitely flipped around the side and shoot that nigga. Over the bottom, something cool. Remember the little on there. In this first video, oh. this house's ring doorbell like, captured a man walk up to the front door in the middle of the night. But rather than actually knocking on the door, the man walk up to the front door in the middle of the night. Did not want to do it. Rather than actually knocking on the door or ringing the doorbell, the man pretends to do so. At first, it seems odd. Until you realize what's actually going on. Near the left side of the screen, a car's headlights can be seen. It's clear whoever is driving the vehicle is making this guy walk up and talk to the house owner for a seemingly sinister purpose, as the guy obviously doesn't want to do it. I mean, so much so that he fakes knocking on the door and even fakes a conversation with the house owner, all the while making sure the driver can see him doing so. Wow, that guy's pretty nice. Yeah, I would've, I would've come outside swinging. Oaks. Oh, so so for the entire time. Wait, there we go. Hey, it was back then, there. Okay. Okay. Sorry about that. Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> From the fake conversation, it's clear the driver wants the man to look for someone named Matt. One common guess the man could have been being forced to rob the place, but didn't want to do it, making him fake the whole situation and claim no Matt lived there. Wow. But to this day, the real motives of the driver are still unclear. What happened to you, boy? This footage features a random woman walking what up that? to someone's front door. The woman clearly isn't place. acting normal. Or at least until a car passes where she breaks character so as not to draw attention to herself. After the car is gone, the woman can be seen putting her face right up to the camera. You go, what the hell? You gotta shoot her for that. You gotta shoot her for that. You got to. After watching the disturbing footage, the house owner that. would claim he had no idea who the woman was. Hey, get the crazy stuff off. Right here. This doorbell camera video shows the horrifying the early stages of a fire in a neighbor's property. Down. As the video goes on, you can see as the fire gradually continues oh, to yeah. grow. That, whoa, so what much the hell? so that it eventually reaches the house with the doorbell camera. At the time what of the fire, sick. the house owner himself was asleep. Though he would be woken up Damn. by multiple notifications on his phone, claiming motion was detected by his doorbell camera. After reviewing the footage, the sick. house owner would frantically run to get a fire extinguisher and desperately attempt to put the fire out. Fire extinguisher nigga? You want call? I have a fire extinguisher on that. Jeez. That's good home ownering. That's a good home owner. So sure, fire. After realizing it was too late, the house owner would escape through the house's back door. It's Don't pretty him, safe man. to say that the motion detected Don't notifications him. that woke up the house owner saved his life yeah, that night. We were dying fiery. We were dying this fiery video death. captured a woman frantically knocking on, on this house's front door. As she continues to do so, well, she can be up. seen constantly looking behind her. Oh man, that's I see when you realize coming. why. A man walks up to the woman and proceeds to grab her firmly, telling her to get into the car. All the while, the woman wow. can be heard pleading for him to stop. That's scary. What the hell? You got to come over and cook. Get that nigga rain on his head. Don't need no lock cops. Come on. Nice hot hit. Is she supposed to be bombing that? What the hell? Stop, so please. No, 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 please. Stop. What the hell? Fight. Oh my god. 
I guess they no fight. The man in the Who's video put your was later identified now? to be 20 year old Victor Kucic. Oh, yeah, that he nigga. would ultimately be charged with third degree felony kidnapping. Yeah, that nigga look crazy. <laughs> that picture. You look crazy. This ring doorbell starts off showing the house owner simply doing her laundry. Though, before she can even enter the laundry room, she can be seen pausing. And the audio from the clip makes it clear as to why. What are somebody in the house? voice can be heard desperately pleading for help. Though, it's oh, unclear as to where the where voice is, is coming from. All right. Clearly disturbed, and worried it could have been someone hiding around her property, the woman would end up calling the police. Oh, there's, uh, you got a gun? I looked like, hey. anybody out the road or any cars or anything. So I went back to my ring video to make sure it was a good thing. Oh, yeah, you I hear somebody saying something, but I guess. Well, I posted it on there. The police would search the whole property, yeah. but find absolutely nothing. And to this day, it's still unclear whose voice was talking, or even where it was coming from. A woman living in an apartment complex had reported that she had been being stalked for months. Police would open an investigation. Though there wasn't really too much they had to go off of. So, guess I'll stay go. That was until the woman's ring doorbell caught the man approach the front door on a bike wearing a mask. The man would actually apologize for stalking the woman, though what he said next is pretty disturbing. I'm sorry. Uh, looked in one day and saw you. Oh, God. I can't stop. What? The man claimed he couldn't stop. Which basically confirms this man is not mentally well. It's a match up. Back. To the point where, unfortunately, he can't help himself. To this day, the woman still reports seeing the man at her apartment. Ah, to this day? Who's come out? When is this? This doorbell out? camera footage seems to have captured an almost transparent looking figure walking across the house owner's property in the middle of the night. Transparent? The figure looks to have no face and Who seems to there? slowly become less visible as it continues to move. Oh, man. The audio from the video gotta get reveals the noise of very faint footsteps. You gotta get over there. And then they get tiptoeing. See that? They keep tiptoeing. She like going up, down, up, down like that. What the hell? Oh, it's getting scary now. It's actually getting scary now. Hold on. After reviewing the footage and examining around the property, the house owner found nothing out of the ordinary. And it's still unclear what exactly was caught on video that night. Maybe wanna make me look around now. The owner of this house would wake up to a notification on his it's phone telling him motion was detected at That's his front door. And after reviewing the footage, this is what he found. Elderly there was an old crazy. woman with a knife just standing at his front door, or constantly that? shifting her body weight from side to side. What a the knife can be seen awkwardly holding and looking at the knife, as well as constantly glancing all around her. Ask me stay inside. You ask me talk the through the door and stuff. Yep, she's crazy. She lost that. head. She's crazy. Uh, sorry. After a few more seconds, the woman finally attempts to ring the doorbell, but seemingly can't bring herself to do it for whatever reason. What the hell is happening? What the hell is happening? Ring it! <laughs> Maybe I. Maybe I. So you think it down? Just ring the doorbell, nigga. And 
after two minutes of footage, it cuts off. It's still unclear who this woman was, or what caused her to walk up to a stranger's front door wielding a knife. I've for so long, nigga, doing nothing. After hearing his doorbell go off, this San Diego house owner would look at his doorbell camera through his phone. And the camera revealed a supposed door to door salesman waiting outside. The house owner decided to confront the man with the doorbell speaker. And that's when the salesman claimed he was looking for the Robinsons residence at 712, which was not the house he was at. After being informed of this, the salesman would politely apologize for the mix up. This is the Robinsons residence at 712. Uh, no, you're at the wrong house. It's 721. Oh, I apologize for that. Suspicious of the encounter, the house owner would send the footage to the local police department, who, disturbingly, confirmed that this exact man was suspected of breaking into at least 19 homes and impersonating a salesman to do so. Time 19? The man has yet to be caught by police. We still ain't got yet? Come on. Likely taking place during the whole killer clown craze clown? of 2016, Shoot them, this ring doorbell caught the exact moment someone dressed in a clown them. costume walked up to its front yeah, door. Them, the person them can them. be seen tilting their head yeah, and slowly walking up to the door, almost the whole time yeah. staring directly into the camera. Yeah, they do that again. most likely them, just someone trying them. to scare people, them with something. there's they a small that chance something a lot more sinister is going on here. Yeah, smile like that, yeah. So, yeah, it's nasty. First, that room when he comes close to the door, you swing the door open. Yeah, I finish down, then I go in. Then you close the door, lock it again. <laughs> they go in, no doubt. You can come that close to the door. What the? Can we fall down the stairs? <laughs> Why are you running around like that? <laughs> to this day, it's still unclear whether the house owner experienced anything further hey, regarding the situation. <laughs> And they go walk around like that. <laughs> you walk around. <laughs> yeah, right. That's it for the video. Thank you everybody for watching. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. And peace out.